craters of the Moon National Monument and Preserve is a vast ocean of lava flows with set. Uh, 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 uh. What you just heard is the opening statement for in. Uh. What you just heard was the opening statement from the NPS website for Craters of the Moon here in southeastern Utah. South central eastern Utah. What does that say? Now some of the things you're gonna to want to do when you come to the park. Now some of the activities you're gonna to want to do when you come to the park. Some of the activities you're gonna to want to do in the park, certainly come in here, take a drive around the loop, and uh, on your second pass around, stop off at the Inferno Cone and take a hike up at the top. But behold, uh, you know, some of the activities you're gonna do if you're into camping, they do have a campground here in the park, and it does have RVs. They've got a nice, uh... If you're looking for a place to stay, there's not really many choices. Uh, you've got Arco. Arco? Well, Adventure Seekers, we're here to confirm it. This park is truly weird. We've seen some amazing things, and Mike's gonna shoot me for that because it's me. This place is truly weird. From trees growing out of practically lava to huge chunks of a crater, to from inferno cone, the splatter cone, lava tubes, incredible trees growing on, uh, growing on lava. <laughs> Mike just gave me a look like walking on top of lava that's 2,000 years old, and walking through the Devil's Garden, Devil's Garden, and of course going through the Devil's Orchard, seeing huge chunks of a volcano that was blown apart 2,000 years ago. We highly recommend. Oh man.